A new kind of drought relief does not require water. State lawmakers are pushing a bill that helps farm workers feed their own families while they feed the world. Senate Bill 1066 would create a pilot program to send $1,000 a month to some farm laborers. Action News reporter Nick Garcia is live in southwest Fresno with why some lawmakers believe the money is essential for these essential workers. Nick. Right, Margo, and State Senator Melissa Hurtado of the Central Valley is the one sponsoring that bill. She says the drought has gotten so bad over the past few years, it's not only hurting some crops, it's also drying up the pocketbooks of farm workers. Drought conditions in California continue to pose challenges for the Central Valley and beyond. Less water for farmers and more fallow fields mean less work for farm workers. If you jeopardize the food security and when you jeopardize farm worker livelihoods, it's going to have an impact at the grocery store and it's going to have an impact on the food systems of this nation. He says in some cases, the lack of work due to the drought has gotten so bad, the people who work hard to put food on store shelves are struggling to put food on their own tables. State Senator Melissa Hurtado says one way California can help is by passing SB 1066, which she's sponsoring. It's really an investment in our own food system. It's an investment in them for the work that they do. The bill would allocate $20 million of the state's budget to send $1,000 a month to eligible farm workers as supplemental income for three years. Senator Hurtado says the drought's impact on the economy is a driving force for this proposed pilot program. California has the country's largest agricultural industry. In fact, on average, it generates $50 billion a year and employs more than 400,000 people. Last year was the state's third driest on record. The drought so bad, UC Merced looked at the economic impact and found the ag industry lost about $1.1 billion and also lost about 8,700 jobs. What hurts the Central Valley also hurts other parts of the state. And that, that means that when farm workers are hurting, I mean, other people are going to feel the pain as well. If passed, the benefits would start in January of next year, bringing much needed relief to thousands of farm workers statewide. It wouldn't solve the drought issue, but experts say it might help some farm workers afford to live in the state with less work in the fields. This is not only about giving them a um, thousand dollars a month, right? It's about bringing awareness to an issue that continues to plague the Central Valley, and that's the drought. And SB 1066 is still relatively early on in the legislative process. Right now it's in the Senate Appropriations Committee. Of course, we'll be sure to follow its progress for you. For now, live in Southwest Fresno, I'm Nick Garcia, ABC 30 Action News. Thank you for watching. For more videos like this from ABC 30, just make sure to hit that subscribe button below.